Hello everyone. As per the request of many our followers, I am preparing this video. My food habits in a day. Yes, different food habits I have. Generally, I take normal food and very less quantity of food. So all these things I am going to share with you. By the way, my name is Dr. Devika Bhatnagar, soft skills trainer, motivational speaker. So when it comes to my food habits, the first thing you must remember is here: I never take hundred percent full. to the stomach i eat only the food which is half to my stomach 50% of my belly will be filled with the food 50% is always i keep it half why it's like this you know i'll give you an example suppose in a mixer you wanted to churn lot of items its mixer is full mixer jar is full can you churn it no if you make it half easily you can churn the same thing is applicable to our belly also so never fill our stomach full 100% this i have learned from two legendaries the first legendary is milka singh milka singh ji so he said in an interview when i have when i feel hungry if i am hungry for four rotis i take only two if i am hungry for two rotis i take only one means you must fill our stomach half only the same thing i have learned from another telugu veteran actor is no more but is a great actor he was a great actor uh, dr akirin nageshwar rao garu so he also said in one of the interview 90th birthday interview in all india radio he also said the same message so these two messages i follow always taking only half of the food less quantity of food that will be always healthy and it will keep your body always happy and energetic also now uh, coming to my food habits daily what i take i am a purely vegetarian i used to take non veg food also till 10th class 10th class i have seen an incident that someone was uh, slaughtering the goat then after that i felt very bad and immediately i stopped taking this non veg food purely vegetarian breakfast morning around 9 to 9:30 in between i take breakfast all items i prepare breakfast like uh, south indian items idli dosa sambar uthappam pesarattu all items south indian items and also north indian items like different parathas i prepare puri alu parathas uh, like uh, carrot paratha and uh, cauliflower paratha radish paratha and uh, dal ka paratha different parathas i prepare uh, so parathas puri and south indian items different different we prepare i prepare generally so whatever i prepare i eat quantity less only not full 100% then after half an hour gap i take one glass of milk so this is my breakfast around 11 to 12 in between if i feel hungry i take ragi malt one glass of ragi malt you can find that recipe in our channel so devika bhatnagar ragi malt if you just search you can get that link how to prepare one glass of ragi malt i i take or otherwise i have prepared some grains like uh, sesame and flax seeds pumpkin seeds these three seeds i have just roasted a little bit and stored in a small bottles so this seeds generally i just chew it then after that having one glass of water enough stomach is full and my lunch will be around 1:30 to 2 o'clock lunch at 1:30 to 2 o'clock at that time what do i eat generally in my thali you can find two rotis pulkas and one cup of dal and a little bit of curry uh, and one cup of rice you will find always uh, curd one cup of curd salads that's it this is my lunch then after that evening around uh, 6:30 i feel hungry rather than taking junk food like samosas or uh, puffs or pizza burger mirchi bhaji aloo bhaji all these things i just avoid it so rather than that i always prefer fresh seasonal fruits 6 to 6:30 i keep always well in advance i arrange everything in well in advance fruits i take sometimes green green tea i prefer green tea with two biscuits biscuits are uh, like multi grain biscuits of britannia fiber rich this kind of biscuits i keep it in advance and uh, sometimes uh, if i feel hungry nothing is available once again the same grains 
flax seeds pumpkin seeds and cecm seeds these three so that's it this is evening and when a dinner comes to 8 to 8:30 i'll have my dinner same items like do roti and uh, two rotis and one curry and uh, dal same lunch menu sometimes i ignore it and i'll have simply rajma rice dal rice pulao or biryani not light biryani vegetable biryani prepared at my home kichdi and uh, aloo tomato and uh, uh, paneer curry aloo tomato matar curry with rice a uh, two roti like i just make it a flexible light food dinner so this will be finished by 8:30 to 9 9 o'clock then after that uh, uh, after half an hour gap or before bed i take one glass of milk so that's it this is my schedule of lunch daily regularly outside food occasionally occasionally i take outside food like when my daughter takes me outside i take pani puri cutlet something something occasionally and when it comes to the parties especially at parties we must be under control nowadays it has become a fashion fashion that many items are available i have arranged around 50 items in my party it has become fashion but what about our belly please be careful don't uh, don't just take everything inside of your stomach don't push it no it's not safe for food it's not safe for stomach so that is why please take what you are st- you are belly accepts this says always yes take this take that and after that the struggle will be only to your belly not to anyone so that is why when i go to parties also there also i choose only the items which are suitable to me less quantity only again half stomach only or maximum 60% i feel but not more than 70 so this is my food items plan by the way always remember what we eat which is going to reflect on our mind what we eat which reflects on our body also that is why if you want to control your body and mind your food habits are very important i would advise you to follow any good diet plan which is suitable for you but never fill your stomach 100% this is dangerous because of this many of the people are having indigestion problem ulcer constipation stomach related lots of problems so that is why never feel 100% and uh, what is suitable to your stomach every stomach every mind every body is accepting something what is that you identify and plan in such a way if this is under control everything will be under control either taking food or either talking in both the ways yes that's all this is the life by the way how is this video did you like it and one more pre- video i'm going to prepare that is a day in my life how do i manage my life i have total five channels and uh, i don't have servant i do everything housemaid work like vessels cleaning the clothes and cleaning mopping everything i do by myself and managing five channels and i also go for training sessions as per the invitation of many people so and handling all these things how do i manage a day in my life shortly i'm going to prepare for you all just stay connected so make your life happy plan it in such a way that you enjoy every day every moment of your life happily that you must be happy that's it now see you soon in another video till that period keep smiling keep shining good luck